Hello there, you're watching Dansky, the place to be to develop your creative skills and grow as a designer. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to draw the Reddit logo in Adobe Illustrator. And we're going to be doing this with Leo as well. This is my son. Say hi, Leo. Hi, Leo. He's not very well, bless him, and we've all been up since really early this morning, so apologies if both of us seem a little bit tired. We are, but we're going to, we're going to make the best of it. We're going to do an awesome tutorial. So to start, we've created a document 900 pixels wide and 900 pixels high. And we're going to select the ellipse tool and just left click and draw an ellipse. Yeah. So for this tutorial, yeah. So for this tutorial, we're going to make it 510 pixels wide and 350 high. You can do that from the transform panel at the top or on the right and we'll just put those in to make it exact. So let's change the stroke weight. Let's go for 16. And then we're going to left click the ellipse tool again and just left click mm -hmm. and hold shift to draw a circle. And we'll position this around about here. This is going to be one of the ears. And then we go to object, arrange and center back. And you'll see it puts it behind. And we can then select this shape and hold Alt and Shift, drag over to the right, and then we've got a copy. Now you can see it's not totally centered at the moment, but what we can do is just left click and hold Shift to select both of these circles, that's both of the ears, and then press Command or Control G to group them together, drag over everything, and then from the Align panel at the top or on the right, just Horizontal Align Center, and you'll see it nudges them into place. And we can then leave these ears grouped, or we can ungroup them from the object menu at the top. I think I'll leave them grouped. Then what we can do is select the ellipse tool again and left click and hold shift to draw a circle. A bit smaller this time, so we can scale that down holding shift. And we're going to position this above the right ear. Now for the eyes, we can just drag this circle and hold alt remove the stroke and give this a fill. So if I just double click on one of these swatches yeah, and then we can pick a suitable color. I think this is pretty close. And there we go. We've got one of the eyes and we can adjust the scaling again by holding shift and dragging from the corners. And we can drag and hold Alt and Shift, and it will drag out to create a copy horizontally. And again, we can do this same technique. So hold Shift and select both the eyes. Go and group them together up here. That's Command or Control G. We've still got our ears grouped, which is good. So we can drag over all of these lower elements and just align these centrally. And you'll see it shifts the eyes into the middle. That's probably quite a good reason actually to leave the ears and the eyes grouped together. It just helps recenter things as you work through the design. Now we're going to create the antenna. It's not a, a complete right angle. It's not quite 90 degrees, but if we start with the pen tool and we're going to left click and hold shift and just create something that is a right angle. And what we can do is use the direct selection tool. We'll zoom in, I think and just drag over these top two anchor points and then either using the arrow keys or the mouse, just hold shift and drag ever so slightly off. And then what we can do is bring this into position and then just give it that little rotation. something like this. At the moment that's around 348 or so degrees and we'll just position the bottom of that antenna in the middle. So if I drag it down here you can see it's nicely between both of the eyes and we can hold shift to then drag it straight up. And we'll just pop this circle on the end. Actually this is behind at the moment so if we go to object, arrange and bring to front we now bring the circle to the front 
and we can go into outline mode that's command or control y and just make sure that we position the center of this circle in line with this top line here and that's command or control y to come out of outline mode and lastly we can select the pen tool left click down here under the eyes and hold shift and then left click and we'll just drag out that mouth and from the stroke panel on the right select rounded cap as the cap type and we've got that mouth and you can curl these up a bit more and you can adjust the curvature if you like just with the direct selection tool just click anywhere on that line and then you can adjust the bend if you like there we go and then let's group these elements together so we'll group the antenna together we've already grouped the eyes and the ears so we can now drag over everything in fact we'll hold shift to deselect the antenna but we can then just realign everything so it just puts that mouth right in the middle as well and lastly we can drag over everything and go to object group click up here at the top and center this on the artboard what do you think what do you think of our reddit logo does it look all right do you approve and there we go that's how to draw the reddit logo in adobe illustrator as always guys please feel free to leave any questions or comments below <laughs> like this video if you enjoyed it take care and i'll see you next time Did you enjoy that? I can't believe he sat still through that. Thank you. Can you say daddy? Daddy. Yeah. Oh. He's playing with the microphone now. Huh? Uh?